Hey everyone, today we'll be reviewing the AC Infinity Plant Kit System. AC Infinity's Plant Kit is the best all-in-one indoor grow tent system on the market today. And I'm not just saying that because I helped with the grow guide used in this kit, which I totally did, but because it's true by such a wide margin in practically every category that there's no one else even close to this kit to compare it with. And that's because they've been able to pull off something that so far only large scale commercial grow companies and extremely expensive solid grow cabinet companies have been able to do, which is to integrate all of the moving parts into one central controller to automate the entire grow environment with just a touch of a finger. But I'm getting ahead of myself here, so let's start at the top. AC Infinity's plant kit is an all-in-one indoor grow system, offering everything you need to start a grow short of a seed and potting soil. It's been fine-tuned specifically for hemp, and the plant kit also does something really smart here, in that it's labeled as a 1, 2, 3, and 4 plant kit, which makes a lot more sense to a beginning grower in what to expect from each tent size. As for the specs, the one plant kit comes with a 2x2x6 feet cloud lab grow tent and a 100 watt ion board LED grow light. The two plant kit comes with a 2x4 grow tent and a 200 watt light. The three plant kit comes with a 3x3 grow tent and a 240 watt light. And the four plant kit comes with a 4x4 grow tent and a 400 watt light. There's also a one plant compact kit, which is the same as the one plant kit, just with a four feet tall tent allowing it to fit in smaller spaces like a closet. All the parts included makes perfect sense for its grow tent size, so there's no feel bad moment when you buy a 4x4 feet grow tent kit only for it to include a 100 watt grow light that can only really power like a fourth of the space. In testing, I got great results with these quantum board style grow lights. And the best part is it can be fully automated with the included controller, which I'll get to in a little bit. The other accessories include a Cloudline inline fan, which is already the industry standard due to its energy efficiency and whisper quiet operation, a carbon filter to remove the odors of the grow space, a cloud ray clip fan that can also be controlled by the controller as well, although I didn't even bother for my first grow since I always just leave mine on 24-7. And there are some smaller things like an elastic trellis net, plant ties, pruning snips, wire management velcro ties, uh, ducting tape, a beginner's grow guide, and some fabric pots. The Controller 69 is the star of the show here, being able to monitor the environment, control multiple devices automatically based on timers or environmental triggers, and provide full app control via Bluetooth, so you don't even need to be in the same room as the plant kit. Unfortunately, you still have to be in the same vicinity though, since this controller doesn't come with Wi-Fi. But there is a Wi-Fi version of this controller if you want to upgrade the functionality later on. By default, you can plug in the inline fan, grow light, and carbon filter to be controlled by the controller. And because everything runs on their universal infinity system, it future-proofs these current devices as well as allowing you to add on more UIS devices in the future. Now, I've seen a lot of cool plant kits take these commercial automation tools, place them in their residential products, and then price them so high that no one's able to afford one. 
there was a Cedo at almost $3,000 shipped. Uh, Grobo starting at $2,000. I talked with Hawthorne Gardening, which is about to come out with this one for like $4,000. It just seems like if you want these type of commercial level automation controls, you're going to have to pay an arm and a leg for it. But somehow AC Infinity is able to sell these kits starting at $3.99 for their One Plant Compact Kit, which is an unbelievable deal considering the quality of the products included along with all the advanced features provided. I mean, it's priced lower than some of the random grow tent kits of the same size, which means that it's able to stay extremely competitive with the market while providing features unheard of for most grow tent users. And I would know, as I've definitely tried more grow tent kits than your average home grower. The only catch here is that due to this, it seems like they're always sold out pretty quickly of their UIS devices every time they restock their inventory. In fact, I bought this two plant kit a month ago and had this review ready for the last couple of weeks but I didn't want to post it because they were out of stock again on all of their models. So I'm only able to post this review now because I saw that they just restocked their one plant compact kit and the three plant kit. Although depending on when you see this, it might or might not be out of stock again. So yeah, uh, if they can manage to keep their new products in stock, I feel like this is going to be a huge game changer and really sets the bar high for the rest of the industry. So until someone else is able to catch up, I can't imagine recommending another grow tent setup for a new grower starting out, unless you're on a super ultra budget. And if you are, stay tuned since I'm testing out this setup, which I was able to easily build for under $100. And once this grow is done, I'll make a video going over all the pieces I used to put it together. And that's it. Like the content? Then be sure to check out our beginner's guide to creating CBD products from scratch available at Amazon in print and digital with links in the description below. You can also find us at hempinapot.com.